Oh yeah, what's up folks and welcome to Ontario History Vlogs. Thank you very much for tuning in. Today I'll be talking about a fountain that's been here in Ontario for the past 114 years. I'm sure many of you have seen it, many of you are familiar with it, and many of you have drank from it. It's on Euclid Avenue and C Street and I'll be talking a little bit about its history. So with the further ado, let this vlog begin. Located on C Street and Euclid Avenue in downtown Ontario is a water fountain that was built in 1908. It was built by the Women's Christian Temperance Union and dedicated to the City of Ontario on July 4th, 1908. The WCTU was an organization very interested in a number of social reform issues including labor, prostitution, public health, sanitation, and international peace. The initial purpose of the WCTU was to promote abstinence from alcohol, which they protested with prayings at local taverns as they seen alcoholism as a social ill. Because of those reasons, this fountain was constructed for people to be tempted to drink fresh clean water rather than turning to booze. It was a luxurious thing at the time for this fountain to be here since water in general was a crucial element, which is why Ontario and Upland exist today. Water was able to be brought down from the local mountains, so George and William Chafee laid out Euclid Avenue and the town thrived. After its completion, the fountain was originally located on the northwest corner of Euclid Avenue and Holt Boulevard, which was then named A Street. It was celebrated by the town and hundreds of people showed up to show their interest and support. Over the years, it moved to several different locations along Euclid Avenue due to various changes in the area and vehicles plowing into it. Damages were always minimal to the fountain, but repairs were not always professional. After being hit one day by a passing vehicle, it was repaired, and the repair consists of rock, cement, and crushed aluminum cans. This past 4th of July marks the 114th anniversary of the dedication and is still 90% original. Today, the fountain is located in front of the gazebo on Euclid Avenue and C Street. The fountain today is still very much functional, however, due to COVID, it's stated on the city's website that it's temporarily closed. This is one of Ontario's oldest remnants still functioning today. It represents a time of Ontario's history that shows what the reform did to ameliorate living standards, promote peace, and to keep the community quenched. So if you're in the area, it won't hurt to stop and take a quick gander at a piece of Ontario's history.